In this lesson, you will learn about ViewCube. This feature was first included in 3D Max version 2009. It makes it easy to change the views according to our requirement. I will show you how to use the view cube and how to customize it according to your requirement. You can change the view by simply clicking on the specific portion of the cube. And clicking on the home button will reset the view to its default position. You can also rotate the view by rotating this ring below the cube. You can also customize this view cube according to your requirements. Simply right click on view cube and then click configure. In the view cube options, you can show or hide view cube or make it active only in current view. You can also change the view cube size. You can make it large, normal, small, and tiny. You can also change its opacity. There are more customization options of view cube, which I will let you explore yourself. In the next lesson, I will tell you how to navigate through the viewports.